click on the subscribe button to watch more videos on my youtube channel to get latest notifications and updates about my videos click on this bell icon hi friends in this video i am going to explain the some of the basic commands already explained the some of the basic commands in my previous tutorials the modifying commands and the basic introduction commands and the introduction to autocad and these are the commands the draw array point array and the some of the commands are there you simply on click on the below of the draw you can observe the different types of commands and go into the first i am going to the spline command let's get started i am going to the spline command s p l i n e spline enter and give the first point and the second point like this you can drag like this you can develop the any of the spline types as you wish and the spline is completed if you activate the spline or deactivate the spline click on the enter three times then only it is this of the spline is disappeared the view disappears the spline after drawing that you want to end the spline you should click the enter for three times then only the spline will ends then you click on two times also it cannot not ends you should press three times and the space spline this is the spline operation the spline is very important command to develop the new of the pipe models and the half of the pipe and the section section plans the spline is very helpful i'll explain my previous one of the basic tutorials and some of the drawings are also explained and go into the spline operation the spline cv this is the cv you want to draw the spline cv i will explain you the spline cv is also some of the best commands uh, to develop the plans and the spline space for first point and the method knots object is also there you want to develop like this simply go into the spline cv and drag like this see the spline is creating from the first end point of the line and the first starting point and end point I will give them one of the example like this. If you have the any of the line of the sum of the distance line aligned or vertical or the horizontal type of lines, how to create this line? This line CV is very helpful. I will show you. First, I am drawing the by using the line operation. I am drawing the two lines like this, like a slant lines on the vertical uh, on the right side on the left side. And go into this plan and start point and the second point and third point like this. You can select the all of the points where you want. The spline is created according with the lines. The spline is created. See where you intersect the point on the operations. By these operations, you can create the spline. If you delete these lines, you can also delete these lines and observe the spline how the spline is created by using this line operations. If you have the any of the dimensions, you can also give the with respect to the dimensions. The spline is created different types of spline, different models of the spline. A drawing is observed on the screen, and I'm deleting the spline. The spline operations are completed. Next, I'm going on to the another command. Is nothing but a construction line. The construction line is on the both on the first point and the last point. This does not have a end point this is the continuous line for example x line this is the operation of the command is x line c want to create this simply drag the mouse and place the lines if you observe the end point there is not exist that um, it is a continuous lines the on the both sides you can observe the line is performed on the both sides this is nothing this is the construction line if you want a single line of the continuous line this is the ray the ray is very helpful the ray space for first point like this these type of lines are very helpful to plan or project projections of the any of the plan or the civil plan drawings this place of and the construction lines are very helpful 
like this you can create like this also then this is the command of the line and go on to the point multiple points if you want the multiple points simply select the point and give the different types of points on the screen and click on enter the points will appear see different types of points are created and the multiple points are created not only the one point the of the multiple points this is the multiple points you can create the different types of multiple points on in the different distance of the x y axis and intersect like this and create the any of the blocks like this the points are very helpful to develop the any of the drawing by using this point the multiple points command is very helpful i'm intersecting the all of the points of the vertical and the horizontal and the slant position some of the drawing is made this is the one of the example then the multiple points is completed next go on to the region command first go on to the region command i will explain the one of the basic tutorial reg enter basic first draw the one of the line by using the line operations i'm performing the all operations what i performing the operations use watch on the command line i'm drawing the lines like this from the horizontal and vertical one of the slant line is completed and these are the individual lines you select this see this is the individual line by selecting the with mouse and drag like this individual i want to give as a region to boundary all of the boundaries in a one position in region select object and click on enter c if you select the object it it delete the all of the at a one time the region is also same as the uh, already explained the explode command like that only the region is helpful then go on to the wipe out this is the wipe out command in the rectangle specify first point in the corner point i'm giving the one of the rectangle like this i am the hatch command already explained the hatch operations in my previous tutorial H enter hatch and draw the wipe out already the wipe out y p e w i p a o u t wipe out and click on enter is space for the first point you want to draw the any of the wipe like this and click on enter the remove of the material is shown see the hatch is removed like this you can remove the material by using the wipe out operations is the one of the example as you wish you can develop the any of the models for so, so many examples are there not only this one of the example this is the one of the example i am explaining purpose i am giving the this example i will create the another wipe out uh, like this i am using the wipe out and click on the wipe out and draw i am drawing the same lines like this and the set scene the rectangle and remove the material and automatically it performs and remove the material the hatch material is removed uh, so the wipe out is command is completed next go on to the some other commands is there i'm deleting this and go on to the draw operation toolbar and simply click on that the 3d polyline and helix and helix and the 3d polyline the helix already explained one of the basic tutorial about the helix do not specify inside diameter of the do not do not and inside diameter give the inside diameter and specify the outside diameter then do not is created c you want to place the do nuts do not is nothing but a washer washer type if you nut and bolt uh, fittings the washers will use you to, to specify the any of the washer type objects the do not is uh, command is very helpful to specify the object for the client this is the washer then the do not specify inside diameter of the do not and give 0.50 and the one like this on the circle operation i'm creating the do nuts like this for, uh, to show to show you and uh, this is the do not operation by this inside diameter and outside diameter of the do not is required simply click on enter after that the rev cloud the revolution of clouds are there these t types rectangle and the polygon and the free hand you want to give the command rev cloud enter and it asks the arc length object rectangle polygon free hand what type of style is required it asks on the command line and i'm giving the rectangle rec enter and draw this see the rectangle type of cloud type object is performing on the screen it automatically performs if you go on to the rectangle again this is also same as rectangle same and go on to the polygon select the first point and the second point and the third point 
like this you can prepare the polygon type not only the polygon you can also create with respect to the distance also you can create the rev cloud by using this you give the same as line command only the you can't do the distance 5 mm 10 mm 2 mm like this you can give the rev cloud by using the polygon also and the rectangle and it is different from the freehand it does not have a dimension so you give this simply without any of the dimensions you simply give the rev cloud in a cloud this is the actual cloud by using the rev cloud this is the freehand sketch this is the models explained in this tutorial already explained some of the basic models in my previous tutorials you can also observe these tutorials are very helpful for the beginners already explained some of the how to create the blocks and the data extractions for the industrial use you can also observe in my previous tutorials and the route cloud specific first point you can give like this these are the basic commands in AutoCAD <laughs>